You never know. Oh, maybe I awarded anyways. Oh, never mind. Nice. Wait, why is Zach there too? Zach was really hovering. I don't like this at all. It's a 4v5. I mean, there's really nothing I can do there. They ping me, like, I don't know what to say. But I don't know why I don't just back off. After you get the kill, just leave. Like, why are you greeting? You know Zach's there. Like, you showed. It's 4v5. I was, like, so grief. And now we got a free kill, and he's just gonna TP back. So it's actually good for Zach. And my jungler's will gonna be behind now. I don't understand why they did that. Yeah, he just has a free cloth armor now. Nice. Well, that's a pretty annoying, because, yeah. Now it's going to be really hard for me to even punish him. Usually you want to try to punish him early on. 46. But now, since he's got armor, it's going to be even harder to punish. He has E start. But it doesn't even matter. Don't let him. Uh, don't want to level my W yet. Thing is, I know the Kendra's gonna come soon. He can just beat my ass for free because <laughs> he has a cloth man. Uh, this is so annoying. Yep, and there's the kindred. The smartest kindred player. Very intelligent individual right there. Wow, he missed his Q, but it ended up clipping a minion, so he was able to actually still get it off. Okay, Kindred's gonna tilt gank top now because uh, she died earlier. Thought she put the mark. I need a Q, or I need to kill this minion. Kindred's definitely coming straight back top. Like, I can't actually engage here and get his passive. I'll just die if I do. I have to just let the wave crash. This land was made for me and me alone. So we just chill for now. Not forcing more trades with the red. I mean, it, he couldn't level one or two because uh, he started east, so it's like really awkward. Oh no, I didn't take me. Okay, I thought I did. I think he did. Sure. You're molding. Bro, how did my Q not kill there? By the way, I, I swear. Like, oh, it's because of the cloth. I forgot. I was about to say, how do I not kill there? Because. Every time I've ever played against attack, it's like you just auto at once each blob and then Q and it dies. But yeah, it's a fucking cloth armor. So he actually almost survived because of it. Because yeah, I was gonna say, there's no way he should uh, be able to survive that. Is this gonna crash? Oh, I have to push those. There we go. 
I'm gonna walk back here in case. Kendrick's really trolling. Nice though. Good start. Do I have an item set on this account? No. I did. First rank uh, season's been terrible. Stuck silver at the moment. Don't lose my lane. At least 80% win. He's bad at carrying. Most likely. Yeah, I mean, everyone starts somewhere, right? You just don't want to become too, like, the motivated if you're, like, stuck in a specific elo, especially in your first season. Like, in my first season, I was stuck bronze 5 zero LP for, like, a, the majority of it in season 6, and back then, that was the worst rank possible. And I had, like, a 30% win rate, so... Everyone starts somewhere. You just gotta keep your head up and just keep grinding. And, uh, as long as you uh, keep in a good mindset and you keep on improving, um, just start climbing for sure. Yeah, so he has no passive, but I don't think I can one. Or do I try it? This it's really gr like greedy to do. Honestly, fuck it. Okay, whatever. I'll take that. It's really hard to burst him because of his ult. But I got his flash. So that's actually like best case because I don't think I ever kill him there. Why is he didn't pop ult though? Nice though. He has no TP, so I can just keep pressuring. It's gonna hard shove here. He's not gonna back. That's fine. Wait, did he actually back? Wait. Oh, he does a. Oh no, his TP is up. I forgot because he TP level 1. Let's say, why is he backing? We're up 30 CS though. I'm pretty sure Alistar and Kindred are both coming, so I gotta be careful. Oh no. He's chud bot. Kindred's on Rift though, I can't stop it though. Yeah. Let's get some I need a little bit of gold. Manage the gas stream, he has a gun candy. Decent little trade there. I'm just probably gonna reset here. So. Yeah, we just reset, we have our item. Big. Actually, nah, I stay one more, cause he's gonna just be able to push the wave in fast. I need to shove this wave. If it was a cannon wave, I would have just reset. But it being a, just a regular wave is kind of awkward. We got boots here now as well. Actually, what am I saying? For some reason I thought I got boots off that, but no. Not even close. Nice though. Nice little 10 minute route. Got pretty good CS this game. An Apex and Overwatch, which is your pair than League. Yeah, I feel like with those like uh, shooters, it's a lot easier to like 1v9 games, right? Because even if your team's bad per se, it, like it's not as team reliant. I mean, obviously sometimes it can be, but not like super, super team reliant. If you're miles better than your opponents, then you can usually just pop off and carry it. But the league gets a lot more, yeah, team focused and role focused as well. And yo, shadow of uh, the knights, thanks to the follow, I appreciate it. Welcome. Hello, hello. I'm gonna hard shove this again. Kindred was bought, so I'm on like any threat really. 
Just ignore him and get another plate here. Oh, actually dismount, I trolled. I didn't uh eat properly or like kill it properly. Alright, we can just reset and get our uh, lucidity boots here and uh, longsword. It's gonna help me pressure a lot more. Oh, wait, actually, I can't even get a longsword. I'm trolling. I thought I had enough gold. I miscalculated. Oops. Ah, whatever. Doesn't matter. Lucidity boots are still good enough for more snowball. Zach got another free kill. Moj. He doesn't have TP yet, so we got another plate here at least. Like we're really far ahead, even though he has he's gotten handed a couple of kills. We're up four plates and 40 CS. And a decent amount of XP as well. I actually think we get the full turret here. Yeah, we do nice. It's actually so huge. Oh, I thought he ulted before. Oh. Whatever. Um, he pushes wave and then we'll grab their grunt. Like, I don't actually have to kill him. I can just take their resources instead. I'm gonna pull this up so they don't have, he doesn't have vision to steal. There's a ward uh, near their blue. He needs to stop dying, though. All we need is open country, but we're gonna take everything they got. Yeah, fuck it. I'm just gonna start this. I, it's a bad idea because they have vision, but. Or not. I guess they're just sacking it, okay, whatever. I mean, I just took their whole top side. That was kind of awkward, but I guess it works. They're literally just letting me funnel myself CS. Read it, yeah. I don't know, they're not even like trying to punish. Yeah, it's really weird. The team is really running it though. Much I love. Only this big sky and this dumb lizard. I need to spend the gold. I had so much gold on me there. They just have to wait for me. We need to kill this kindred though. If kindred's alive, it's so hard to play. Wait, what? TP top. Are they just sacking it? I, mean, I guess Kendrick can play for steel.
Or actually, I guess he TP'd for the Herald. Just give it. I get two turrets here. Or like, I get a turret and... I guess so. Like we... Nah, but like, why are we like, hinting so much this game as a team? Like, I get so much if we just don't end. Yeah, this is like a D2, D1 game, I'm pretty sure. Or maybe I'm wrong, maybe it's not. I I could have sworn this account was like high diamond though, but maybe it's lower than I think. Okay, guys. Nice. We're just getting fucked, I guess. Whatever, I mean, I'm funneling myself so much gold to 1v9, hopefully. Oh, this is... Getting a bit out of hand with the... Oh, wait, I just trolled by buying a uh, Warhammer, actually. Ah, yeah, whatever, it's fine. You're insane, dude, you're insane! That works. I will 1v9, it's fine. Whatever, I'll just use this Warhammer front of Ori after. I misclick though, I meant to buy uh, something else. No meaning, but your death shall. Get over here, buddy. Yeah, they just confirming our suspicions, ain't they? What? Wow, he's so fast actually with that one. So fed though. And Baba links the fall, I appreciate it. Welcome. But you see how strong I am in this game, even though I barely even had kills early on? Like, I had a couple of kills, but like, I didn't uh, really focus too much on getting kills. It was more just making sure I'm farmed up and just pressuring. No, I just have like a humongous like, lead. Zach couldn't do anything to punish me after I got ahead. They're probably coming for me, I can't even stay. It kinda sucks. But yeah, it's hard for me to play into their comp like 5v5 as well, so I don't want to really force team fights if I don't have to. Hey, it's going bumsy. So that's why I'm trying to play sides a lot. Because Kendra can just cuck me with her ult, right? And then I'll just get focused afterwards and die. I got the turret here. This is huge. Like, I, I literally have... Holy fuck, never mind. Wow, they actually moved so much faster than I thought they were going to. That's what I was talking about, about Kindred one-shotting me, or like, cucking me. Ah, oh, fuck, I trolled. I thought I had more time. I should have just instantly ulted away. And I should have ulted down, actually. I shouldn't have ulted up. If I ult through their base here, it might be fine. Wait, I thought I had a little bit more time. I'm trying to get around the one time with my leg. Enemy kill. But my team's just like actually just permitting. This is really annoying. Yeah, that's so bad actually. Fuck. We're gonna lose Baron off that. Hey! It's forward Admiral Major Clint! I she used ult, we can win yet. this. My Pantheon has to just ult him. Oh my god, I stole it. <laughs> I stole it with an auto attack. <laughs> They're so fast. They're so bad. <laughs> Bro, like, what, what is this game? This game is so cool. I mean, I'll take it. <laughs> 
Favorite part is they all just like dipped away from my ult, so it redirected me into the Kindred right in the pit. So I was able to just auto the thing. I saw she wasn't smiting him, so I'm like, fuck it, I'll try to auto it once. I actually just get it. No smite needed, actually, though. Oh yeah, th this is just, this is something, this game. Almost four items, though, at 20 minutes. That's actually crazy for only having seven kills. Just because of how much farm I funneled myself. And I've gotten both uh, tier twos. But yeah, I I still can die if Kindred ults, so you have to be careful about that. I hope his Kindred is griefs. Wasting their time. I almost actually griefed. I walked up a little too far there. No scar. No bad scar. I can't even voice that all. Oh no, she didn't. What? Wait, I thought I saw her alt pop. What the fuck. Wait, I guess I'm seeing things. Fuck. Oh, I saw her ult go off. Fuck. Oh, Silas. Oh. True, true. I was like, I could have sworn I saw a Kindred ult. I forgot there was a Silas on my team, if I'm being honest. Because <laughs> I was like, yeah, there's no way I didn't see a Kindred ult there. Well, at least I'm not hallucinating. Thought I was for a second. I think it's honestly a uh, random one's angle this game. Especially for Kindred ult. I usually like to just go damage here, but I definitely think it's random ones. Really good into Kindred and Jin. A man without a weapon ain't worth oh, I think it's a uh, random ones for sure. I just so used to the hallucinations, bro. What the fuck was that? <laughs> yeah, I guess we won. Nice. Almost 300 CS as well. <laughs> So bad though. <laughs> I didn't become a rear forward brigadier. Nice Good job. Couldn't end though, that's kind of annoying. Plaid mid, it's pretty good. 
Definitely think uh, there's less like hard counters mid lane than top lane, and also the roll itself is just more impact. I was queuing it a lot during preseason and not the beginning of the season a bit, but then I just decided to go back to top lane. But I definitely think Flood mid solid for sure. Just depends on uh, what you prefer, honestly. They're both pretty good. Decent. But yeah. And I mean, yeah, against like the super like high range oak champs like Victor, Syndra, Azir, and Nivea, stuff like that, it's pretty hard to play. But against like the more like medium to low range mages and stuff, like say like a Lux, for example, or even like an Annie, um, that kind of just shits on them. <laughs> Goodbye. Wait, Penta? Where's my Penta? Oh, they have FF'd. Moj. All oh, game, though. Nice, nice little 1v9. That's what you gotta do sometimes if your team's in thing. You just gotta, you know, play for yourself and 